The Restec GC Accelerator Kit reduces oven volume in Agilent 6890 and 7890 GCs equipped with mass spectrometers. This allows for faster oven ramp rates and quicker cool down times, which means faster chromatographic methods can be developed. Existing methods can also be sped up by transferring them to scaled down columns using the ECGC method translator, which can be found at www.restech.com slash EZGC. This free online tool calculates the ramp rates and other conditions that will produce an equivalent separation in less time. The following are standard ramp rates in Agilent 6890 and 7890 GC ovens. Here's what's attainable in those same ovens with the GC accelerator inserts installed. The Restec GC accelerator kit has been designed specifically to work with Agilent 6890 and 7890 GCs equipped with mass spectrometers. The accelerator will fit in GCs equipped with other detectors mounted in either the front or back positions of the GC. Although the only recommended use is with a front or back installed inlet and a mass spectrometer. The presence of certain switching valves and or GC by GC modulators in certain models restrict the placement of the GC accelerator inserts. The GC accelerator is not recommended for columns on cages that have a depth of greater than 40 millimeters. Restec recommends wearing protective gloves when handling the GC accelerator kit components. To install the GC accelerator, turn off the heated zones in the oven, inlets, detectors, and MS transfer line and wait for them to cool. Ensure the column and the column hanger are in the back position in the oven. Then, if no detector is in the front position, install the two block inserts in front of the column as shown. If there is a detector in the front position, install the two block inserts as shown. Be careful that the block inserts do not touch the analytical column or the MSD source nut. Finally, install the plate insert in the front of the oven so that the front is flush with the edge of the oven. To remove the GC accelerator, turn off the heated zones in the oven, inlets, detectors, and MS transfer line, and wait for them to cool. The metal fasteners and label tag on the plate insert may still be hot, even after the GC oven is cooled down. To avoid burns, use the strap to remove the plate insert or wear heat-resistant gloves. To remove the plate insert, grip the strap and remove it by pulling the bottom edge out first. Remove the block inserts carefully. Do not allow them to contact the column or the MSD source nut. For more information on Restec GC Accelerator, visit our website at www.restec.com/gcaccelerator.